Hello everyone, here is Rupiel and this is another video about Castle Clash. In this video we are going to do Hebe Monsters with J, the last stage of Hebe Monsters. So, first time we are doing this full garrison with Town Hall level 17. Unluckily we have a split spawn, so they will destroy two army camps from two, two corners and that's a really bad thing because army camps guardians are tanking damage sadly pumpkin not progged but pew pew my heroes just kill enemies like an ant spirit mesh is three really dangerous hero but he was killed pretty fast i want to say sorry for every single luck that will be in this video but i have already fixed that thing and in future videos there won't be any lags. Now all my heroes procs and killing spirit match is not a problem because my beautiful immortal with his procs tuned and killed spirit match. Now let's see what's going to happen. That's not the best spawn. Let's see everything is going pretty well but oh I've just lost Thunder God and Spirit Match. Two of my heroes on third wave. That just a J3. Two heroes lost. That was three bad spawn. But now let's see what's going to happen. Ornithopters going into my base. They will tank down my tower tower disappeared now enemy heroes are targeting my druid they are going to kill my druid no no druid stay alive please druid and druid soloing everything now druid versus druid which one will win my druid is the best haha <laughs> j4 cleared with only four heroes without Spirit match without Thunder God. Now, last wave. What's going to happen in the last wave? Let's see. Because everything can happen. And I, <laughs> and I lost. Because enemy pumpkin proc and everything started lagging so much. Anyway, that's a town hall level 18 with added maze. Puffing longer. Puffing is much longer. First wave. Oh, some hero traps, bombs blowing up everything around. Spirit match proct once. Spirit match proc second time. And spirit match disappears. Only lost one building in first wave. That's a really good, good result, without any towers lost. So I have all 5 towers standing with full garrison. Hopefully they will shoot enemy heroes, but sadly I am not using green garrisons. And only one tower lost, second wave. Nothing big happened. Now, in third wave we will have a self-destruct hero. It's probably a ninja, but I'm not sure. So let's see what's going to happen. Third wave coming from pretty good spawn. It's a druid side and spirit match. Okay, spirit match procs once, spirit match procs twice, and spirit match disappears. My druid just one shooted spirit match. Only one hit from my druid and spirit match disappeared. That's amazing. Okay, wave 4. What's going to happen? Ornithopters will destroy some of my towers. First tower destroyed. Second tower destroyed. And only two towers destroyed. And great, the great Immortep killed 
and cleared that wave. Enemy heroes didn't even get inside my base. Okay, now the last wave. What's going to happen? Last wave. Cupid proc'd, Thunder got proc'd, Immortal procs. Come on, I lost two heroes already. Come on, and the great Immortep and Cupid working together cleared J5 for the very, very first time through PL, first time in the history. Cleared J5, but it's not the end. You have to like this video, write something in comments, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see J5 without Garrison. So, Thanks for watching and till next time for you through PL.